everyone in the current session let us discuss about orange book which is nothing but approved drug products with therapeutic equivalence evaluations orange book is published annually by fda now what does orange book contain the orange book identifies drug products approved on the basis of safety and effectiveness by the fda and it contains the therapeutic equivalence evaluations orange book contains therapeutic equivalence evaluations for approved multi source prescription drug products and these evaluation they serve as public information and they advise the state health agencies prescribers and pharmacists to promote public education in the area of drug product selection and to foster the containment of health costs the primary motive or principle for introduction of orange book is the containment of health care costs in order to contain or reduce the health care costs each state it either applies positive formulary or negative formulary so first what is positive formulary it lists therapeutically equivalent or interchangeable drug products that the pharmacist may dispense it lists the therapeutically equivalent or interchangeable drug products and when it comes to negative formulary as the name indicates it lists drug products that are not therapeutically equivalent and or the interchange of which is prohibited in other words if a drug product is not in the negative formulary the unlisted generic drug products are assumed to be therapeutically equivalent if they are not in negative formulary they are assumed to be therapeutically equivalent and if they are present in the positive formulary they are assumed to be therapeutically equivalent so each state either it can append positive formulary or negative formulary now coming to the backdrop of orange book as we have discussed earlier to contain the drug costs each state have adopted laws and regulations that encourage the substitution of drug products in other way they promote generic products they have opted for either positive or negative formularies and because of number of requests in late 1970s for fda assistance in preparing both positive or negative formularies the fda has decided to provide a single list based on common criteria to evaluate the drug products and this is the basis for publishing orange book now let us know when the first orange book was published on may 31st 1978 the commissioner of fda sent a letter to each state official that it would provide a list of all prescription drug products that are approved by fda along with the therapeutic equivalents and the orange book was distributed as a proposal in january 1979 it included only currently marketed prescription drug products approved by fda through new drug application which is nothing but nda and abbreviated new drug applications that is anda under the provisions of section 505 of fda nc act and the fda regulations at that time and a complete discussion of background and the basis of fda's therapeutic equivalence evaluation policy was published in federal register on jan 12 1979 and the first publication of orange book was published in october 1980 now coming to the major contents of orange book the orange book it contains approved prescription drug products with therapeutic equivalence evaluations and it contains approved otc which are nothing but over the counter drug products 
for those drugs that may not be marketed without NDA and ANDA because they are not covered under OTC monographs. List of approved OTC drug products for those drugs that may not be marketed without NDA and ANDA. And then it has a list of drug products with approval under Section 505 of FDNC Act administered by Center for Biologicals Evaluation and Research. It also contains a cumulative list of approved drug products that have never been marketed that are for exploration or for military use or have been discontinued from marketing due to various reasons. These are the major contents of Orange Book. It contains approved prescription drugs, approved OTC drug products and drug products with approval under Section 505 that are administered by Center for Biological Biologics Evaluation and Research and a cumulative list of approved products that are not marketed. According to Orange Book, the drug products are divided into two major categories, category A and category B. Based on that, it has a list of evaluation codes. So which drug products come under category A? The drug products that are considered to be therapeutically equivalent to other pharmaceutically equivalent drug products. They come under category A. And the drug products that FDA at that time does not consider to be therapeutically equivalent to the other pharmaceutically equivalent drug products come under category B. Now let us discuss about therapeutic equivalence evaluation codes. As we have discussed earlier, now let us discuss about category A which includes drug products that are considered to be therapeutically equivalent to other pharmaceutically equivalent products. Category A is further subcategorized into AA, AB, AN, AO, AP and AT. AA indicates drug products in conventional dosage form not presenting bioequivalence problems. AB is used to describe products meeting bioequivalence requirements. AN code indicates solutions and powders for aerosolization. AO indicates injectable oil solution, O for oil. And AP indicates injectable aqueous solutions. AT indicates tropical products. So these are the evaluation codes for drug products under category A. Now let us discuss about evaluation therapeutic equivalence evaluation codes for category B drugs. The drug products that FDA at that time does not consider to be therapeutically equivalent to other pharmaceutically equivalent drug products come under category B. B star indicates drug product requiring further investigation and review to determine therapeutic equivalence. BC indicates extended release tablets, extended release capsules and extended release injectables. BD indicates active ingredients and dosage form with documented bioequivalence problems. D for documentation. BD indicates active ingredients and dosage forms with documented bioequivalence problems. And BE indicates delayed release oral dosage forms. BN indicates products in aerosol nebulization drug delivery system. N for nebulizer. BP indicates active ingredients and dosage forms with potential bioequivalence problems. DD indicates with documented 
bioequivalence problems and BP indicates active ingredients and dosage forms with potential. P for potential bioequivalence problems. BR indicates suppositories or enemas for systemic use. And BS indicates products having drug standard deficiencies. S for standard deficiencies. And BT indicates T for topical. BT indicates topical products with bioequivalence issues. And BX indicates insufficient data. So these are the various therapeutic equivalence evaluation codes for both category A and category B drugs. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe for further videos on pharmaceutical sciences and other disciplines.